what's up everybody it's your boy jamel back with another embroidery video today uh, i'm going to be showing y'all this design being embroidered out on the happy japan 12 needle voyager using a eight by nine mighty hoop all right this design will be available on my se page so make sure you go to my se page the link is in the description and purchase this design is gonna come in like six different sizes. All right, so I got some big news for you guys. Your boy Jamel is now an affiliate with Midwest. We all know them as Mighty Who. All right, yes, I am now an affiliate with Midwest Products, Mighty Hoops. Y'all know. They sell the Mighty Hoops. Let me reach back here and get one of my Mighty Hoops right quick for y'all. So y'all can see for people uh, who may just be getting into embroidery, all right? All right. So Midwest Products sells the Mighty Hoops, everyone. These hoops are super, super, super good they make life way easier than using the hoops that came with the machine all right so for the people who are going to be getting uh the multi-needle machines make sure you grab you some mighty hoops and make sure you use my affiliate link in the description so you can get you a percentage off and also use my free shipping code also in the description so you can get free shipping on your order okay but you have to be in the usa to be able to use that free shipping code so today we're going to be using my eight by nine mighty hoop to stitch out the bear so um we're gonna get to that in just a minute put that back up there and i want to give a shout out to midwest one more time for considering me and making me the official affiliate of the Midwest products, which is Mighty Hoop. Let's give them a big shout out. Let's do it. We're in there. All right. So, um, before we get to stitching out this bear, um, like I said, the link is in the description if you want to purchase it. I think it's gonna be fire. I want to actually put uh stitches out on a shirt for my my sons i have a 10 year old and i have a four year old twin son um so this is out put this on on this shirt i'm gonna change the the color of the name you know and stuff like that so they can tell this shirt apart even though they should be able to tell it apart because one is older than the other but you know how kids are they'll try to put each other's clothes on and stuff like that but other than that man make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on your post notification bell every time i upload a new video you get a notification um so without further ado we about to get over here to this machine we about to stitch this out so y'all can see how i stitch out i told y'all i was gonna be dropping my designs i was gonna be dropping them on Etsy. so um every design i drop i'm gonna make a video for it so i'm probably gonna have a lot of videos of me stitching out designs on youtube all right so Let's get over there to the machine and get started.
everybody. The design is complete. It has finished stitching out. Y'all see it right there. Call that the sauce barrel and get real close so y'all can see all of the detail. I did not make it an applique because the shirt is going to be the background. Whatever color shirt you put it on, that's going to be the background of this design, okay? Also included with this design, I'm going to show you guys. Uh, you will be getting the uh, no mind. I'm, you will be getting the EMB file, which is the Wilcom embroidery file. So if you want to go in and change anything, if you have Hatch embroidery digitizer, if you have Wilcom, um, I think another program you can change it with is I can't think of it. I can't think of it. But I'm gonna tell y'all in the next video once I once I remember. <laughs> but if your program can open EMB files, you can go in and manipulate or see how I digitize this design right here, all right? So you can change the size if you want it bigger, you can make it bigger. I already have it in like six different sizes, but if you want it big, super big to put on a, the back of a hoodie or anything, you can go in and do that with the EMB file and it won't lose like, uh, uh, uh any quality and stitches when you resize it with the emb file or if you want to make it an applique you have the choice to do that all right the emb file is in the files along with the design worksheet and everything also as you guys can see i use my eight by nine mighty hoop all right so this hoop is great make sure y'all make sure y'all go to uh midwest uh, products just type in mighty hoop on google and it should pop up all right use my affiliate link to get you some some a percentage off and use my, my free shipping code also to get free shipping only if you're in the u.s other than that man i'll see y'all on the next video but make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button subscribe and turn on your post notification bell hit my Etsy page up if you want this design, I'm going to see y'all in the next video. I'm out of this thing. Peace.